Aren't you guys tired of getting misled by garbage? Like, really? All these games that seem to be coming out, not all, I shouldn't say all, but a majority of these games that just come out, they get, like, they initially have some hype. And they have, like, some trailers that look really cool, that make the game sound all cool. But it's like the trailers are super misleading. Just like for this for this Walking Dead game, this game is an extreme garbage cash-in trash game. And it's super boring, super repetitive. No story to be found at all. But the trailers made it look like it was going to be a, another Last of Us. Misleading. Garbage. Fallout 76. They're like, oh, you can do all this cool shit. It's like, I, I don't buy into hype for games anymore. I don't waste money on games anymore. Because of all this. It's like, if you go out day one and buy a game... That you haven't seen gameplay for, you are stupid. Like, I didn't buy The Walking Dead de game day one. Somebody got this for me. And I played it, and I was like, this is absolute garbage. And I gave them the game back. I don't know if they were able to get a refund or what. But this game is absolute garbage. Okay? And it's not just this. It's like, all these developers are, like, misleading people. And I know this is like, they've always... The game trailers always make the game look better than it is, but... When it's complete, when you when they show something completely different, and then give you something that's absolute garbage, how do they even get away with this? How is it not faulty advertisement? How is it not suing? How is it not all of that? Because this is trash. How are these developers getting away with it? Okay, I don't care if it's the biggest developer out there. Are the smallest developer out there. It doesn't matter. If you are going to mislead people for money. And get people's hopes up for trash. Like I remember even back in the day. This was what really made me. Not spend $60 on games anymore. Was. Watch Dogs. The original Watch Dogs. I remember that game being hyped up for years. I was hyped for that game. And when I got it, I was just like, I played it for a little bit. I was like, the hype was in there. I was trying to like, be like, oh man, it's great. And then it was garbage. I never even finished that game. It was so boring. It's so boring. Maybe if I, I got I found that first person mod that someone released, maybe I'll play it in VR. I'll finish the playthrough eventually. But I just, uh, it's just not enough for me to play through. It's garbage. This misleading shit. Whether it's graphically misleading or whether it's story misleading, or whether it's just the whole package is misleading. Like Fallout 76, so many people were hyped for that game, and it was absolute garbage. It was broken garbage with reused assets, a tremendous amount of glitches. And these developers that don't take their time and release an unfinished game, why do they do that? It's like, oh, we have to meet this deadline before Christmas. Like, remember Sonic 06? That could have been a great game. They never patched it at all. They never patched the game. They never tried to fix anything. There's a loading screen every 10 seconds. It's not a bad game. It's actually one of my favorite Sonic games. But just the fact that they they left that unfinished pretty much and just had it out there. They were just like, oh, we don't really care. It's become one of the most hated games. It's just these developers are so stupid sometimes sometimes they have these amazing ips that could be amazing next level games that could revolutionize shit like could you imagine right now like what if they brought back sonic as a fucking icon beast and they had like an open world game you could like call another character like you call up tails he comes and flies or you have this cool like bullet time mechanic like i could brainstorm shit all day for so many different franchises that have these awesome characters that they just ruin with mediocre or just garbage games in general like why have we not gotten a great amazing like walking dead like game no they're all trash I mean, Telltale, it's not really a game. That's like an interactive, like, show, in my opinion. It's like, it's not bad, but it's not an actual game. This is garbage. And these multiplayer-only games, I don't know. The, uh, multiplayer-only games should be free. 
period. Multiplayer only games should be free. And because every game has like microtransactions in it nowadays, and it's just modern gaming. It's like, yes, we're going to get amazing games that are revolutionary still, but we're also going to get a lot of this misleading garbage because so many people buy it because hype is real. People buy into hype and then they're like, oh man, I'm going to play this. And then it's trash and then they, you don't really do anything about it. You can't really do anything about it unless you have Steam that you could return it. <laughs> boom, boom. Fuck them. And these consoles don't have that. You buy the $60 game. Like, let's say this upcoming Anthem. It, it's probably just going to be like Destiny. It's probably just going to be a grindathon, multiplayer only game with like a barely non existent story. It's so dumb. These endless grindathon games. I get that some people could like that could be appealing, but I want a deep story with great gameplay and great graphics. I want it all, okay? Even if it's like an artistic type of graphics, like Breath of the Wild. It's just these developers aren't putting enough time and effort into games nowadays. They're just kind of cranking out mediocre garbage because they can. It's the same thing with the music industry. An artist will get comfortable with a certain sound and then they'll just kind of go with that and not really innovate or go anywhere from there and just hop on mediocre beats. It's it's the same thing can apply to multiple different things in life. But that's just my input on some of the modern games that have been coming out that have just been misleading garbage and not really worth your time, money, at all. Just misleading, should be sued for faulty advertising. I was just making sure my computer didn't crash there for a second. The video had uh, stuttered there for a second. But there you go. Have a great day. Have a great life. And if you want to see my uh, initial thoughts of that garbage Walking Dead game, the video is on my channel. It's absolute garbage. I deleted it after I played that. <laughs> there you go, folks. Peace.